right? What is this? Geez, Sam, what's going on here? Uh, I was doing some experiments with soda and didn't notice that everything, uh, spilled out. Well, look at this mess. I guess the experiment was a success. Two, just don't worry, I'll clean everything up. Oh, really? Of course, a scientist is always responsible for the consequences of his experiment. Oh, I'm glad you're so responsible. I hope you had fun playing with soda. I had so much fun! I adore both experiments and soda! So you'll surely like my idea! We're going to make our own soda fountain machine, which will carefully pour soda into the glasses! <sighs> it's a great idea, Sue! I could burst with happiness! Okay, I'm going to start. Join me when you're done cleaning! Oh, so hard is the scientist's fate! Hello, guys! Do you want to make a soda fountain machine from cardboard? I'm sure you do. To start, we need these two buddies. Also a piece like this. This L-shaped piece, and... Hello, everyone! And I hope I'm not late, Sue. You're just in time, Sammy. Can you guess what we're going to do now? Sure, we... We... Uh... We... Wait a minute. Are we going to build a house? Are we building a house, Sue? <laughs> you could say that. We're building a house for soda. It's a whole castle and I'm its keeper. Let me finish, Mr. Castellan. Castle? Who? Castellan. They used to call castle or fortress keepers this in the Middle Ages. Well, I like that. Sounds impressive. Seems like I start getting into a new character. Ladies and gentlemen, it's me, the Castellan of the Soda Castle, and my assistant, Sue. Bravo, bravo. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> Sammy, actually, Castellans look different, but you were cute. Right, guys? This is what our machine looks like right now. Great, now let's move on to making the face of the machine. Wait, are you saying the machine has a face? I mean, it's a front panel where you put your money and push buttons to get your drink. Oh, I love buttons, Sue. Great, Sammy. Why don't you make buttons for our machine? Okay, and why don't you guys subscribe to our channel? This way, everyone will be busy. <laughs> Boss Sam. Here I've prepared a piece of cardboard approximately 16 by 28 centimeters. And I cut out a 9 by 19 centimeter piece. I used a cutter for this. But be careful and don't be shy to ask an adult for help. The blade is very sharp. Then, you have to cut a hole like this to insert money. Soda isn't free, right? <laughs> we also need to cut out a hole for the button. Speaking of buttons, Sammy! The buttons are ready, Sue! Wow, well done. We only need to glue them to the front panel. I can do it myself, Susie. Of course, Sammy, go ahead. I'm glad you're helping me. In the meantime, I'm going to draw 12 identical circles for the next stage. Hey, Sue! It's done! Let's see. Good job, Sammy. Except for... What do you want to say, Sue? Not all the buttons are in their places, Sammy. Right? Yeah. I guess I mixed them up a bit, Sue. No problem, Sammy. We'll fix it a bit later. Now we need to stick these guys together. What's wrong, Sammy? You look very sad. I'm sad I messed up the buttons. Oh no, Sammy, please cheer up. We all make mistakes at times. Really, Sue? Of course. Don't you remember how Fluffy once put his head in a box and couldn't get it out? <laughs> right. Thanks, Sue. I'm feeling way better. Guys, if you agree that usually Sam is an amazing assistant, give a thumbs up. And we are inserting the skewer into the cylinder. By the way, this little stick is about 12 centimeters long. I'll use some glue to secure it. This thing looks like a barbell. A very tiny and light barbell. It really does. Look at it. Now we're going to hide our barbell in a piece of cardboard like this. Or you can use craft paper instead. Sammy, could you... Bring some insulating tape. Wow, I don't understand how you do this. What exactly? Reading your mind? Yes, and guessing when I need your help. I suppose it's simply my job, Sue. 
Let's see if you can read my mind this time. What do you say, Sue? Oh, Sammy, you never stop impressing me! So let's put three rubber bands on the barbell. That's what we'll call it. Uh, I love soda, especially Coke. No, Fanta. No, oh, I don't even know. They're all cool. We're all set. By the way, guys, what is your favorite drink? Write in the comments. We'd love to read them later. Now we need four popsicle sticks. I made two holes in sticks beforehand. I think adults can help you with that step. I wish I had invented the first soda machine, Sue. I'm not so sure, Sammy. No? Why not, Sue? Well, I think the first soda was sold in pharmacies as medicine. What? Oh no, Susie, you just broke my heart! Soda in a pharmacy? Ew! Right, we also need two cylinders like this. Each of them consists of eight cardboard discs. I think I'd like to start my own cafe with soda and ice cream. Guys, would you come to my cafe? Write in the comments what you think about this idea. Hey, you dreamer, you're gonna miss your favorite part. It's time to install the motor. Look, I'm attaching to make sure that the cog wheel is on the side of these little spools. We're almost there, guys. Soon we'll see the mechanism in action. Phew, I'm not late. Perfect. Guys, to make our system work, I've connected the motor to a switcher and a battery. Let's finally test the mechanism! Okay. It seems that it's working! Hooray! Now we need a bottle cap with two holes. Hey, this cap reminds me of the one we used last time when we were making a soda dispenser, remember guys? Only that dispenser didn't have buttons with numbers and it didn't take money. Hey, that machine had its own benefits. It… Shh! No spoilers! Let the guys see it themselves. And you guys, don't forget to give a thumbs up! This will help Sue wake up in a good mood. I heard you, Sammy! Um, Susie! I know what it is! You do? Come on, surprise me! This is a pump which will deliver soda through the tubes with the help of the battery! Now we put the mechanism together using the soldering tool. Guys, ask an adult to help you with this step. Carefully now. There. Phew, the most difficult part is done. So, Sam, are you ready for experiments? I'm always ready. We only need to attach the pump to this tube. Well, I can explain everything myself. Go ahead. So, we connected our pump and the chain to the motor. And when we push this button, soda will flow. Well done, Sammy. And now... Voila! Everything is in its place! Hey, Sue, what are we gonna do now? Now comes the most interesting part. We're making a hole for soda. Inserting this tube here. Another tube? Oh, this system is so complicated. And here's your favorite soda! Right, the last step is to cover the front part. Guys, be careful with hot glue. I'll glue it here carefully. Hmm, something's missing. And... Top. And the finishing touch, our roof. Today, we made this amazing soda machine! If you want to see more cool crafts, give a like and subscribe to our channel. Hey guys! Subscribe to our channel! See you in our new videos! That's all for today! See you soon!